Rais wetu wa Jamhuri ya Kenya Dr. William Samoei Ruto and all protocols observed. Mimi nimekaa hapa nikasikiza viongozi wa wakiongea. Na wanaongea ni kama wanam defend rais. Na kwa muda mrefu katika taifa hili mjadala umekuwa about the leaders. The leaders nani alipata nini nani hakupata lile nani anataka kupata hili alafu na, na lose focus tafadhali kwa hamu hii ya rais William Ruto waje tusongee mambo ya viongozi tena mambo ya uchaguzi ilikwisha IBC kadikilea kiongozi Supreme Court kadikilea kiongozi ni jambo gani lingine linaweza kufanyika ambalo linaondoa huyu rais kwa kiti bila tutapoteza huu muda namna ina kuongea 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 Rais ako kwa kiti by right alipewa kura na wakenya he doesn't have to apologize to anybody or seek forgiveness for everyone Rais le jambo ningependa tu kuomba ni kwamba wakati viongozi tuna focus sisi kwetu na kujenga manyumba alafu naweka perimeter wall hiyo perimeter wall unafungia nani kule nje ni wale wananchi wa kawaida sana ukisikia kule samburu watu wanakufa They are real people, they are real persons. Ukisikia kule marsabi to one watu wanakufa, they are real persons. Ukisikia wananchi wanalia kwamba wako na shida ya maskini, they are real persons. They are not just statistics. Mimi nakuomba kwa sababu wewe ulirun on the hustler movement. Bila mwananchi wa kawaida. Wakati utajenga uchumi maana tumekusikia huko na mbinu ya kujenga uchumi. Huyo uchumi kikua tafadhali let it grow for everybody. It's grow just for the elite, the few elites. Let it grow for everybody wananchi wetu watoe kule chini kule mashinani pia wainuke jambo la pili ambalo ningependa tu kukuzia ningependa mniwe kidogo ni kwamba hii mambo ya usalama ya hapa Rift Valley mimi nilikuwa RC hapa na nilipambana na mambo ya usalama hapa kabisa kuna mambo rais ambaye hutawahi kuambiwa jambo la kwanza ni kwamba wakati mimi nilikuwa RC for three years na nimeona PS Raymond yako hapo hakuna hata ndururu and i mean one cent ambayo nilipewa kupambana na walifu not one shilling jambo la pili au maofisa wetu ambao naona wanapigwa marisasi na kukufa hakuna hata mmoja anapewa allowance ile mshahara ambayo ile ofisa anapata huko kule kabedo yule mshahara ambayo askari amesema hapa ngata kwa traffic anapata this no incentive whatsoever number three, hata chakula tu chakula kule inafika mahali askari wanafanya an unholy alliance na majangili wapeane risasi ili wapewe mbuzi wa kule tumejaribisha kabisa na hao watu wamekuwa emboldened mheshimiwa rais nimesikia watu wakisema kwamba jeshi ikuje pale sisi tuliomba jeshi na rais ambaye aliondoka alitupatia jeshi for 10 days yale mambo ambayo alifanyia kule na ya conservancy ndiye alifanya mimi nikasema hii kazi mimi nitawacha kwa sababu mnaambia jamaa coordinates ndio hizi Majangili wako pande hiyo au wanakuja wanapiga bomu pande hii. Maana wenye ngombe, wenye mifugo, wenye nani ni wale watu ambao wanakaa nao kwa meza mjipanga mikakati ya kumaliza majangili. Hiyo walifi itakwisha namna gani? And then jamaa wanaamka siku moja wanakuja wanatangaza wanasema kwamba operation imekwisha wananchi warudi. Excellence kama kuna kitu utakumbuka tu pekee namalizia hapa usikubali kukuwa shielded from your people usikubali kukuwa shielded from the truth maana kama kiongozi kuna uwezekano watu wakuonyeshe tu kile kitu ambayo wewe unataka kuona pekee yake ukikuja hapa unakuwekea carpet unakuja hapa unakaa hapa unatoka umeka gari pale unapanda na kumpa hapa nyuma watu wamewawa uwezi kuona hiyo please Don't lose touch with the common man in That's the only way we are going to grow accounting. Na mimi nakwambia waziri mheshimiwa rais sisi kama magavana tumesema kazi yetu ni kushikilia serikali mashinani. Asante. Kuhakikisha kwamba maendeleo mashinani yanapatikana pinue hali ya maisha ya watu wetu. Tunashukuru sana kwa maombi ya leo Mheshimiwa Mungu awabariki. Your Excellency sisi kama magavana wa the Greater Rift Valley tuko na agenda katika kaunti zetu